Anyway, with these fucking Star Wars prequels, I'm always forced to go back to screenwriting 101. And a big four-letter word that comes to mind. Fuck. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is crap. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is shit. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is piss. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is poop. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is garbage. Nah, I'm just kidding. The word is tone. And for those of you who don't understand what I'm saying, tone is how a movie feels. Movies are either like comedies or dramas or action movies or thrillers. If they waver on the tone, you don't know what it is and your brain starts to hurt. Typically, you should establish what your movie is in the first 10 minutes or so. Take Ghostbusters. You establish your characters. They're witty and funny, and your audience gets that this movie's gonna be some kind of light-hearted comedy thing with ghosts in it. There isn't a violent rape on a pinball machine in the first 10 minutes of Ghostbusters. Nor is there a pie-in-the-face gag in the opening of Citizen Kane. In Revenge of the Sith, what appears to be a general space adventure film is punctuated by a brutal decapitation mixed with bizarre attempts at slapstick humor. This whole sequence from the beginning to the crash landing goes from an intense, confusing, and complicated space battle to awkward slapstick. Did you press the stop button? No, did you? No. Oh, it's you. Then suddenly it becomes dark and violent. Then back to awkward comedy. Archie. Then I don't know what the hell the tone is supposed to be here. If it's supposed to be funny or exciting or scary. I, I, I can't feel anything. 